The comfort zone is where you know what to do. The stretch zone is where you challenge yourself to take risks and learn new things. We went abseiling, ziplining, and rock climbing. Abseiling was the hardest because you can um, never like see what's behind you. You just have to trust the rope to hold you. After every student finishes, most teachers do the activity also. I was most of the time in um, the stretch zone. I took risks and um, did things I've never done before. So first, when we arrived, the owner of Sunny Farm showed us how water filtering works. We used sand, uh, activated carbon pebbles, and a piece of tissue to build our own watering system. We also got the chance to teach school kids how to make their own bottle, and we had a lot of fun making new friends. We don't get to go outside of the city often, so it's really trips like these that help us see a whole new community that is not familiar, and we have a better understanding of where our food and water come from. It's all about having lots of fun and getting to know your teachers and your classmates better. It might be like challenging because you're living away from your parents for a few days, but actually it's really an eye-opening experience. You can do many things that you're not usually able to do, like life experiences, and keep it for the rest of your life. We visited a charity where we donated lots of things and we learned how to make traditional food there. Then we played games with them. Where we went to is just a small part of the world, but you actually learn a lot about the world out there. It was really hot. It was hard for us when we were hiking because we were really tired and we thought we were about to die. And I thought the whole experience was unforgettable. We got to help two families and not only build houses, we got them rice cookers and a desk for their daughter. Community service is it makes you feel really happy that you helped someone who's not as fortunate as you are. <laughs>